everyone and welcome back! Easter is coming so I decided to do a video with ideas how to make your easter eggs prettier and also I will show you one project how to do a cute easter rabbit. Sorry about that. I can bet you're gonna love my ideas so stay with me and if you like the video push like or subscribe to my channel if you still haven't done it. So let me start now. For the Easter rabbit I need a pair of socks, white, black and rose textiles, glue, thread, a ribbon, scissors and rice to fill the rabbit. So the first thing you should do is to fill your cousin's or father's or boyfriend's sock with rice. The one that I use is the long style one, you can use basmati or black rice or whatever you want to. So I decided to use this, I don't know how it's called, instrument, <laughs> sounds more professional, to fill the sock with rice. Attention! Oops. Okay, this wasn't a good idea. Okay, there is rice everywhere, so wait. Okay, so maybe it's better to use this instrument to fill the sock with rice. There is a problem with the package. Oh my! Wait, okay, another instrument. If you have hole in your package as I have, you can just put it in a big cup like this. And how you got it it's like this, now it's better. So here we start. At the end, we fill the sock with rice. This way is easier, guys. So this is the way to fill it, obviously. You should tight the head of the rabbit. Ta da! Now it has a body and a head. Now we should cut the ears of the rabbit, so we just cut it here. You can decide how long to make them. After we can make the shape of the ears better, of course. The shape of the rabbit is ready and now he needs to see the world, so we cut little circles from the white and black textiles for the eyes. Hello rabbit, are you able to see me now? Mm -hmm. So now we're gonna make his teeth to give him the ability to talk. Now our rabbit is able to see me and to talk with me, right rabbit? Yes! Hello! Do you like me? Yes, we do, but now we should make a belly for the rabbit. Oh, wait, I was going to forget the most important, the ribbon. And your Easter rabbit is ready. Do you like it? Now I will show you my idea how to make our easter eggs prettier. All you need is an egg of course, fresh or dried flowers and wire. My egg looks a bit like gypsy, it isn't painted yet, because the orthodox tradition says we paint the eggs the day before easter and I will do it next week. So what we do is to twist the wire carefully and then we thread the flowers on it. It looks like a beautiful wreath and you can make it for most of your eggs. If you want at the end you can also draw a face to the egg. So that's all from me guys, I hope you liked my ideas, if you did please let me know in the comment section, if you didn't let me know again because as you know your opinion is always very very important for me and I would really love to know what do you think about it. And uh, yes, actually I'm thinking to do more of those Easter rabbits uh, next weekend when I'm going to spend Easter with my family because this is something that I really, really, really like to do with them. Actually, my home is full of little cute things, but one more Easter rabbit is always welcome. Yeah, I hope that maybe some of you likes to collect cute things at home as well and you know, if you have this kind of mania, don't worry, just leave yourself to the inspiration. Do as many Easter rabbits as your heart feels to 
and just let it go. I wish you happy holidays, happy Easter, happy new year and see you next weekend. Love you. Bye.